Hey everybody, let's talk about bug out bags. You've got one, I've got one. Everybody loves their bug out bag. And what is it for? Well, let's be honest. It's supposed to be for a crisis or an emergency, not just for screwing around. Now, if you find yourself in a crisis, in a survival situation, whether it was a hurricane, an earthquake, a civil disorder, whatever, it doesn't matter. If you find yourself in that position, there is one critical component to your survival. And you're thinking, uh, my rifle, Paul, uh, water, food, a compass, a, a, uh, you know, a sleeping bag, shelter. No, all that stuff is cool, but it's just gear. The most critical component is you. Yes, your body and your mind. But in a survival situation, you're going to put your mind and body through greater stress than it's been through in a long, long time. Unless you're in the military or a, a SWAT officer or something where you do it all the time, chances are, you know, when the hurricane hits, the earthquake, the whatever, that you're going to be under a lot of stress. How do you take care of yourself? Well, number one, hydrate. Drink a lot of water. You may be sleeping rough hours. You may be up late. You may be walking, going places you've never been to. You're going to stress your body out. The number one component is you, and you need to take care of yourself. Now, recently I was thinking about what could I take, what could I put in my bug out bag to take with me in an emergency situation, in a crisis situation, to give me that little bit of extra. And, well, if you're a fan of Student of the Gun, you know uh, that thing is SWAT fuel. The 9mm Plus P, it gives you that little bit of extra bit of energy, but it also gives you mental clarity and focus. And the cool thing about SWAT fuel is I got 30 doses of this in a, in a bottle that weighs maybe, what, an ounce? As opposed to, you say, well, well like five hour energy, man. How many five hour energies would you have to pack in here and consider the weight and the size of five hour energies or something like that? And I also have the 40 caliber multivitamin. You're gonna be stressed out. You're not gonna be sleeping as well as you normally do. You're probably not gonna be eating as well as you normally do. The 40 cal can help you get through. Also, we've got the single dose packages of SWAT fuel. If you can get your hands on those, you can stash them in there. So, bug out bag, lots of gear, but the number one component in survival is you.